I was uh, getting a new Rigol uh, DM858E, another uh, updated hardware version, but I was thinking, oh, if they are sending a Maya, uh, uh, for me a new one, maybe it is also possible to upgrade the version from uh, e version to a non e version and i have to pay then the difference in cost and i did so after a while i received this uh, new rival for me so i'm wondering if this is uh, solving the problem one uh, interesting note is that i see some sticker here and it is standing here updated 2024 30 of May, so maybe there's some hardware changed uh, done via the via Germany, but okay, I don't know, let's uh, see. So let's continue, possibilities and more, okay, interesting. So this seems to be indeed a complete new one. Um, The power adapter. Yeah, okay, let's switch it on, I would say. It looks like that this is also a little bit different than my previous one, the USB with this kind of locking mechanism. Okay. So let's play a little bit. I have set up, done as what I did the previous time with my earlier DCV uh, auto range uh, failure. I have uh, <coughs> here my uh, programmable power supply. I put it on serial mode uh, so you can go to higher voltages. I have uh, connected my old O1 multimeter and, uh, on uh, the, the output of the uh, power supply and of course the new DM858, no E, uh, with the newer hardware version uh, 101. And let's see what, uh, what it will bring. So now it is measuring one volt and what is happening if I measure, I want to set the voltage to 33 volt. And as you can see, it is uh, going uh, well. So if I go back to one volt and I will set it for instance to another value, 34, no problem, if I go back to one volt and I select 32 as you can see there is no problem <clears throat> um, before I uh, uh, made this video I was already powering up this for at least a half hour because I didn't want to have some some uh, warming up uh, issues uh, there were no uh, any issues uh, but I was uh, before recording I, I did uh, like to do that uh, so um, okay yeah looks good I would say another test is maybe to say I put now on the millivolt range so I go from millivolt to 32 volt in one step and as you can see it is uh, yeah it's working uh, as expected and that is what you want to see so again uh, uh, if you look to the system it is hardware version 101 and the system version is 153 i did make a kind of uh, little program of uh, on, on the unity to switch every time to a different voltage back and forth to one volt and to uh, 33 34 and then one volt so i i will sh demonstrate uh, the let's say kind of stress test if you like so what i have to do is i select here the list i 
select uh, I have already prepared a kind of file and um, if I do this one with one volt in between uh, let's say read this one yeah and now um, if you can hopefully you can see it on the display but it will start an, um, doing a sequence of different voltages so I, you have here one volt then it will be uh, for one second then 32 volt for three seconds then again one volt for one second 33 three seconds one volt 34 volt three seconds so I increase that up to 38 and I will stop on the number uh, 13 here so uh, now let's start then you can see it so you see here 33 volt 1 volt 34 1 volt 35 36 37 and then ah it is stopping one below 13 because the number zero is not okay but that, that that's fine okay let's do the same but then for an, uh, another voltage i prepared already another kind of list read yeah and here i select now the millivolt scale so it is 100 millivolt for one second 32 volt three second then going back to 100 millivolt one second and then 33 volts so i increase it so let's do that uh, again but then with this lower voltages so that we force the ragol to go to into the millivolt scale Thirty-three millivolt, thirty-four, thirty-five. Yeah. Okay. That I think uh, it's working uh, as you expected. Um, I uh, yeah for me it is a new meter because it is uh, without E and I have also the feeling that this meter is faster than the E version uh, not because of the update rate but when uh, a, a voltage is displayed or a number is displayed it, it is stable and it is not really changing a lot while I've had the feeling the, 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 the E version is a little bit slower and takes another step before uh, the voltage is uh, becoming stable but that's, that's subjective because I cannot uh, prove that but nevertheless I'm uh, happy that I have uh, uh, upgraded now to the than the, the non-e uh, meter but okay uh, the most important thing i think is that uh, it looks like that the uh, dc voltage uh, outer range failure is uh, gone and um, yeah i uh, i will do some more tests and uh, i will keep you updated uh, uh, for new findings i also want to do retest all my other uh, uh, things i already uh, collected and uh, yeah i hope uh, you liked the video and uh, yeah see you next time hopefully thanks